Hello everyone. International Women's Day? Just another day. And yet, not just another day. Time to reflect on achievements, on ourselves, on how much of journey we have generally covered and none of it, I'm sure, has been on a bed of roses. It's a day of hope, reflection and the celebration of gender parity in all walks of life. International Women's Day encourages people to actively choose to challenge stereotypes, broaden perceptions, fight bias, improve situations, and celebrate women's achievements. Our journeys are actually stories of grit, passion, determination. These are stories of thrive over survive, very clearly evident from the dismal percentages of women in STEM, STEM, in higher studies, in corporates, in general, right? As we go higher up, the number comes down. Well, at Datamatics, we boast of a good 38 to 42 percent women population throughout the year, but it can be better and it should be better. And through various initiatives, conversations like Women Touring Series, Welcome Back for Returning Mothers, annual coffee cake and candy chat sessions, we unify to amplify the voices of women and close gender gaps in the workplace. Today, I must share a couple of things that have worked for me. One of the most courageous things you can do is to identify yourself, know who you are, what you believe in, and then decide where you want to go. And the related quote will be, always go with the choice that scares you the most, because that's the one that's going to require the most from you. So here I refer to my academic journey, academic career that I had pursued for two years as a professor and taking that plunge, knowing my salary goes down five times and I can never be sure about the fact that when I want to return to corporate, I will get what I deserve. It was scary. Giving up the corporate identity, money, safety net of a stable job, but I stuck to my conviction that this is what I wanted. My colleagues in academic world would often joke, so Dr. Rima, you are typically the kind, uh, uh, the monk who sold his Ferrari. So never had a Ferrari, but nonetheless, that was an amusing comparison. But um, trust me, following your passion at every point in time is a great inherent motivator. So the serenity prayer I followed always, prayer to the higher powers, grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change courage to change the things I can and wisdom to know the difference. The theme of International Women's Day 2023 has been selected as innovation for a gender equal future. This theme has been chosen as women continue to fight for equality, entering traditional male dominated sectors of science, technology, engineering and maths. It's worthwhile to remember that some women-led inventions uh, clearly tell us the power of empathy and, and how the women would have thought about some of these inventions and uh, how they actually help mankind. It's very interesting to note that disposable diapers, non-reflective glass, paper bags, dishwasher and the foot pedal trash can, these are all inventions of women. Wishing you all a very happy Women's Day to a strong, intelligent, talented and simply wonderful women of this world. Don't you ever forget that you are loved and appreciated. Let us all honor, respect and adore all the amazing women in our life on this International Women's Day, whether they are your mother, wife, daughter, friend, whosoever. Let's demonstrate our pride in their achievements and commitment to building a world which is free of all ills for women. Every journey is unique, every journey has its ups and downs and we must respect the fact that the pace of every journey is different. If I have to give you that one tip on this special day today, it will be about finding a mentor for yourself. Define success for yourself, what that means, find someone who's already successful and can give you the guidance. Mm -hmm. So typically the word mentor is gender agnostic. 
so it can be anybody just find that someone who you look up to and who you who would always be that tailwind for you i have been on a paid forward mission last weekend when i was a part of uh, vital voices mentoring walk in association with red dot foundation prerna anti human trafficking ngo so i cherish the experience of being a mentor to a girl from a disadvantaged background but who was very clear in her mind that she wants to be a manager in the corporate world i am enjoying this journey and i urge you to be a part of social impact projects as much as you can finally quoting mahatma gandhi be the change you wish to see in the world happy women's day once again take care stay safe